Okay, to add external custom links to your videos through annotations, it's actually really, really easy. Uh, what you're going to want to do is first and foremost is click on your little username or your uh, avatar in the top right hand corner. Uh, go down to Video Manager. And then on the far left, you're going to want to click on Channel Settings and then Advanced. Uh, now, uh, on the associated website section, this is going to be the area where you specify the domain where you want to be pointing your links to. You can only have links to one website, but you can have as many suffixed websites from there. So let's say, for example, if I wanted Sam does that forward slash portfolio forward slash portfolio item, I only need to actually enter Sam does that. I just need to show the root, that's all. Um, once I click add, you will then be presented with uh, one or two screens. It will either be one which walks you through the verification process, which is a really, really simple little process, provided you have access to the uh, website that you're choosing so that you can't just add, rand add random links to random websites. Um, or it will just instantly uh, verify it and click on success like it has done here because I'm, I, my account, my Google account is already associated with my domain. Uh, once you've done that, all you need to do is just drop back into your video manager, choose a video that you actually want to uh, go ahead and customize. So I'm going to go ahead and select uh, my last video that I did. And then as, of, as you would normally, click on Info and Settings, click on Annotations, and then all we need to do Hi is guys. just and then all we need to do is just create ourselves a new annotation. So I'm going to go a note, and this is going to be link to a an area on my website. And I'm going to go ahead and just drag that into the middle. And then where you've got the little link tick box here, you can click on link and then click on associated website and then type in the associated website you've just typed in and then any suffixes that you require. So let's say, for example, um, I've got a portfolio piece at portfolio forward slash one. Um, that will then pop up. I will then be able to uh, save that, publish it, and then when I click on viewing my live video, Hi guys. I'm going to drop that all the way down. That links to Sam does that forward slash portfolio forward slash one. Uh, so it's not limited entirely to just that one link that you enter in. That just kind of basically points it in the right direction where you're going to be starting all of your links. Um, and that's it. That's all you need to do. So hopefully that should give you a bit more of an insight on how to do that. And it's a, uh, like I said, really, really easy to set up. It doesn't take very long at all. And it's a really, really quick and easy process.